hello, I'm the Bullmeister, and welcome back to Dragon Quest 2. Yes, we're still in Moonoran. Primarily. Because we keep getting attacked. Of course, during the course of the last episode, well, we, you know, did a... Got a few things done. Like, for example, we gave, uh... Randolph a spear. I can't get it. Yeah, we gave we gave Randolph a spear. He can now do some he can now do some pretty hefty damage. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, he can do some damage. And damage is what we need. Well, of course using Fizzle will help too. Because it should take out each of the enemies one at Ah, uh, time. There we go. Centipede's down. 48 and 90. That rat's okay. Yes, I know I'm using a lot of magic, but right now it's helping take out some of these enemies. Especially since Jangles is getting his behind quarters kicked here check our map because we haven't done that in a little bit all right jingles you and that centipede will be fast friends though so, like we're making not only are we making progress but we're also making money Gotta have that all. It's all about that money, money. Enemy is defeated. 58 experience points, 60 gold. We are. Oh, we're gonna have to cross the puddle of poison. And we are in Moonbrook. Woe is me, I, I am he who was lord and master of this once proud castle of Moonbrook. My dear, dear daughter, the Princess Ginny has been cursed to roam the land as a common mongrel, a stray dog. Ah! Oh. That, sh that she should suffer such humiliation is... So she is just a mere... Oh. Corpse corporals and cobra kings. Well, we know Sizz takes out these corporals for these, uh... These Cobra Queens pretty fast, as long as they do damage. So, yeah, we'll just let you take work on finishing off the... There we go. And you're hallucinating, great. Hopefully that doesn't mean too much of anything. Dazzled. Dazzled or bedazzled. Either way. There we go. How good is that experience points? 126, 77 gold coins. We should probably go ahead <coughs> and use a medicinal herb. Okay, that helps. And then Randolph, your spell here. On chance. Go ahead and heal yourself first. That's completely restored. And then heal Jangles too. There we go. Perfect. Open the treasure chests with nothing inside. Smogs and corporal. Uh, corpse corporal as well. <coughs> I mean, thankfully we healed. Randolph, of course, starts to hallucinate. Missed. We'll just attack, I guess. 
Yeah, Dazzle, I think you're blinded? So, yeah. Don't die on me, Randolph. Please tell me you can leave. Oh, you can't even heal. Well, go ahead and use your one medicinal herb on yourself. <clears throat> There we go. Break through the dazzlement. 138 experience points. Drops a treasure chest. Suit of leather armor. Just talk to this flame here. To the east of the castle, in a place where it's maybe espied four bridges. There standeth the separating swamp. Beneath its foul surface lies raw sacred mirror. Was that I? But that I had passed on this knowledge ere I braved my last. So there's a mirror we need to collect. Metal slime! And it ran. Dang it. Metal slimes are great for experience. Uh, I can't even get over that way right now, I don't think. Alright, we just We need a strike. And hopefully take out Okay, Corpse Corporal's done for. There we go. Alright, so Randolph. 68 experience points, 43 coins. I'll hurry up, talk to you. We hold the forces of Fel Hargon to batter down the gate. Save us. Goddess, deliver us. Oh, Metal Slime attacked. Sis! Oh, no! Took one damage, and of course it did. Uh, Jangles, use your medicinal herb on Randolph. He needs it. Oh boy. Yep, nope. I think we're gonna die this time. I think we're dead. Blinded, hallucinating. Alright, Randolph, you're practically on your own, my friend, because Jangles is... Jangles is dead. So... Oh, critical hit! Nice! Not gonna be enough, though. You're gonna be dead before... Yeah, you're gonna be dead before you can say Christmas, Christmas dinner. However... Oh, well, we got 363. So, we had plenty... Resurrect. Randolph should be... F yep, 40. It's 5 gold per resurrection. That's a 5 gold increase per resurrection, I should say. And you're to resurrect it. Nope. However... Can I... Okay, I don't know what to do about the, the dog at this point. Can I? <laughs> no, that's, that's message speed. There's a wizard over there, but I don't have a key. And of course, if we leave, Dock. So how? <coughs> Let 
Yes, we'll save. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm actually going to go explore that real quick. This is going to be another edit. So there, I'm going to mute everything. I'm just going to turn off the mic and I'll be back in a minute, a few minutes. All right, I'm back. I figure out where I need to go. It's the one thing I... It's the thing we learned about. We're healed. Yeah, we're healed. Okay. It's the one thing we learned about that I did not... <laughs> oh, now I got heal slimes. Great. Uh, let's see if Sis does anything to the heal slimes. This does does a lot. Yeah, because we're gonna need to we need to do some damage. A lot of damage. 84, 35. Not getting a lot of gold though. There's our golden tickets, though. We'll do Magus first. Uh, or not. 23 damage. Yikes! <laughs> Enemy are defeated, 90. Uh, we shall heal, I think. Shangles is healed to 45, we'll take that. More importantly, Randolph needs to heal. 28, that's still you again, Randolph. I just want you to be, there we go. I want you to be healthy enough to survive. All right, so there's the castle. Summon all ant, huh? Sis on the centipedes. <laughs> and now I can attack. Lowered where we need to be, but we'll take we'll take all the damage we're getting out of it right now. Just because I need to deal some damage. Pretty. Somebody level up? Probably Ramolf. I mean, we're both. Oh no, Jengles is a level eleven. Strength by two, agility by one, resilience by one, maximum HP by two. Oh, and Randolph, they both leveled up. They were close in levels too. Uh, Randolph level 9, it's strength by 1, agility by 5, resilience by 2, HP by 1, MP by 2, 30 gold coins. Oh look, there's a tower. Where I was gonna beat up some ants here real quick. <coughs> Excuse me. Ants don't carry a whole lot of money. Oh look! Something is sparkling. Bubble slimes. Uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna assist the bubble slimes. Push, push, push. There we go. All right, let's torch the zombies. There we go. Oh, critical hit! Nice. 123 experience point, 62 gold coins. Examine his ground at his feet. He, we find Ra's mirror. <coughs> it's an item we needed to find, and it's the one item that I actually needed. I'm not gonna lie, we're gonna go ahead and use heal. 
on Jangles. There we go. That should help us hopefully get to back to town. Because there's a certain a certain animal. And with the centipedes, thankfully. Hopefully and thankfully with the centipedes. We'll eventually get to where we need to go. Ten points. I mean, we'll again take all the damage you can get because the more damage we can get dealt, the, or the more damage we can deal, the better off. Especially, I mean, we're level eleven right now. Forty-eight and ninety. Just enough for one final sizz. So, I mean, that's it. Once we're there, we're there. The centuries are defeated. 48, 90. Again, the gold coins are the most important thing right now. It helps me outfit some of the party here. Rosmere! That can't be used here. Can I use... How do I use Rosmere? We'll go out. Or do I have to go back and use the mirror? Okay, so I'm looking at the dock. Chimera or Rosmir. Uh, uh, pierces the depths around Mir Rosmir. Beautiful princess can be seen in the reflection. The mirror shatters into a thousand tiny fragments, and with that, the curse upon the princess is lifted. And we have ourselves a princess. Tis a relief indeed to be returned to my own dear body. I had feared that I might be cursed to bark and beg forevermore. Well met, savior mine. I am Ginny, princess of Moonbrook. As I suspected, thou art already aware the castle of my home was laid waste by the minions of Hal Hargon. T'was the brutes who did transform me into a common mongrel and banish me here. But what was such humiliation compared to my people suffering? Must not dwe dwelt upon it. Pith profiteth, the profiteth thy not. Come, let's let us join forces that me vanquish our common enemy as one. Alex, we got. We went to Moonbrook and we got ourselves a princess. Oh, I don't even know because we went to Moonbrook already as it is. All right, so now we have ourselves a full party. Jenny is, of course, level one. She is a mage, level one, 32, 20 in HP, Cyrus, Cypress, Cypress Stick, Plain Clothes, Strength 2, Agility 22, Resilience 10. Already have max HP of 32. See if there's anything that Jenny can equip from the armor. So that's point. All right, she cannot equip any weapons that we have here, which is fine. And she cannot equip chainmail as well. So, so she's gonna be kind of, kind of hurting, hurting for some defense. That's okay. Uh, do I have anything? Can she wear... We did pick up some leather armor. Nope, nope. Can she wear leather armor? I don't know. Let's... Oh. Equip the chainmail transfer. Jenny cannot wear. Okay, so we'll sell it. <laughs> Which, yes, we will sell the leather armor. 113... Puts me just just shy of a thousand. Can you do anything? Leather shield, of course, that will help. Oh, she can use the divine dagger. You know what? Hey, 
anything to equip anybody right now. <laughs> oh, speaking of, I want to check out. Jenny's got mid heal. 85 to 100. How much? That's only four. Nice. Jenny also knows, just only knows mid heal, but mid heal is going to be a lot better than heal. So I can use her primarily as a healer. 24 gold, because that's now 8 gold per head. And blocked in. <laughs> I don't know if I've really been paying attention, but I think the music changed. All right, let's see if we can't head to Moonbrook again. We got an army ant. Also, <coughs> but it's an orb. That helps. Oh. Some bubble slimes and some smog. Bubble slimes. Let's seize the smogs. Jimmy, Jenny can attack the bubbles. That's four damage. That's not bad, actually. So I'll we'll just leave Jenny as the bubble slime for right now. I mean, she is only level one. So, like, it's actually pretty impressive right now that she's doing any damage whatsoever. If this doesn't level up Jenny already, I don't know what will. Apparently nothing will. Alright, oop. Uh, okay. Yeah, you can attack the smogs. See if that'll do any good. You'll let's have you strike the Cobra Crane. Four damage on the Cobra King. Okay. <clears throat> Not a big deal. Jangles is taking the damage, which is appreciated. Again, yeah, she's doing four damage, which is very impressive. Considering she's only level one and the guys are about level ten apiece, this this is going to be a level up for Ginny. There's no question about it. Level two, agility by four, resilience by two. Notice no strength increase. She learns snooze. 129 gold coins. Let's see if this helps any. Father, father, it is I, Ginny. I really read that earlier. Hmm, who speaketh? Is somebody there? I see no longer. Hear no longer. Feel no longer. Okay, well. Oops. Oh, it's... We are in combat! And three damage! But still having the extra... Having a little extra attack is going to help against Quartz Corporal. Perfect. Enemies are defeated. 68 experience points, 43 gold coins. Uh, east of the castle. We found the we found the mirror. Oh, some smog to the Cobra King. We'll get Jenny to attack that Cobra King. Hopefully eventually Jenny will get a little more strength to do some damage, which I will be greatly appreciative for. Alright, so Smog and another attack on the Cobra King. Again, Ginny doesn't have any offensive magic yet. She'll definitely, I mean, I'll definitely use her as a healer here soon. But for right now, 73 experience points. Yeah, like she's got Snooze, which will. I'll look at that in uh, 
and combat as it were. Apologies for the flashing. Centripede, it's not a big deal. Snooze sends the enemy into deep sleep. Centripedes are tanky though, so like Jingles is only doing 13 to the centripedes. Uh, 32, which should be another level up for Ginny if I remember right. That is level three for her. Agility by three, resilience by one, HP by five, MP by seven. Yes, please. Oh, princess, my princess, what what that I've uh, what that I could have guarded thee better. Alas, thou were by vile magics transformed and banished unto a far-flung town. Yet if some brave soul could retrieve Rosmir and show thy true face in the polished depths, then might the curse upon thee be lifted as last. Wanderer, will thou, will thou come to Princess Aid? Wilt thou save her? Can it be? It is a miracle. Princess Jenny, you are f yourself once more. But how could this be? Ah, oh, the Wanderer, of course. And he has gone away from this mortal coil. Whoops. I do want to use Jenny's mid heal. Now this restored. So will be Randolph's. And Jenny's as well. All right, let's rock and roll. All right, we're two now for the those dots. I don't even know, but we will go uh, for the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. And tomorrow we'll find ourselves somewhere. I don't know where yet, but we'll find ourselves somewhere. But until then, I am the Bowmeister, and as always, I've been obediently yours.